Here we are back with the 1950s Easy Go. Um, as you can see here, it has the solid state speed controls. Um, I've, uh, on the last video, I reconnected this dangler here, and uh, when I stepped on the gas, we got nothing. Uh, basically, just uh, you could uh, hear the solenoids clicking, but there was no drive. Um, I've got it all jacked up here, so when it is moving, we won't, we won't be taking off on me. Um, I traced it down, and it looked like it was happening. Only the speed controls were going off, not the, not the one for forward and not the one for reverse. Uh, they weren't making contact, so there was no juice for the speed controls to control. Um, I traced it back down to this switch that normally is in the uh, up here in the dash, so you can switch between forward, off, and reverse. Um, you know, the switch looks pretty old, but it's I don't know. I thought it was working. So what I'll do is I take the wires that were in there, and basically it just shorts together the uh, the control control wire, which goes to the speed control, and uh, either forward or reverse. We're going to go ahead and hard code it into one here. Let's see if I can do this with the phone. Not easy to do with the phone. There we go. Okay. Make sure that's not touching. And that should put us into gear here. We've got the uh, multimeter telling us we got some juice. Get a little sun in the way. This will measure how many amperes are running. Let's see, we should be good to go. Oh yeah, as you can see I'm holding on the gas pedal here. And I, I want to discharge the battery. So in order to do that, I'm gonna put this rock, hold down the gas. All right, look at that rattle. All right, so I'm just gonna let it discharge the battery and then I'm gonna run it through my uh, different array of battery chargers here, which I'm using to cycle the batteries. Uh, with this, I can charge either one six volt or uh, two six volts on, on a high rate of charge. And of course, I got only one battery desulfator. I need to get some more of these. And then once I get them all going, I'll charge them all at once, which is probably where I'm at now with this puppy. Uh, that's the latest on the 1950s Easy Go. Stay tuned.